Hey you guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in Adobe Dreamweaver CS6 and I'm going to be showing you how to link pages within Adobe Dreamweaver. So there's a number of ways to link pages. You could be linking to an external website, which is not your own, or you could be linking to internal websites, which are other pages on your very own website. So let's go ahead and talk about those now. So the first one that I have here, I've already linked to my other website, which is my Premium Tech Tips website, which is my primary website. And in order to do that, all you have to do in Dreamweaver is go over here to the Design column if you want to do it the easy way, or you could go to the Code column here and do it within HTML. But if you go to the Design column, all you have to do is highlight that text and then down here in the lower end of the page, you will see an option that says link or hyperlink. Here you will type in the HTTP colon backslash backslash and then type in your website URL. Once you do that, and then you go ahead and preview this in the browser like Google Chrome. Make sure you save everything first just like that. You will now have an external link like I have here that will go directly to your other website that you're linking to. Now, if you notice down here when I set it up under target, I put blank. If you click on blank there, it will open it up in a new tab and they will not leave your current website. If you do parent or new, it'll open it up in the same tab and they will leave your website. Now we're going to talk about linking internal pages, which are pages on the website itself. I'm going to go ahead and link this about me text, which is right here, to my about me page within this website. So all I'll need to do is select that text just like so. And then if I go down to my link option here, I can just click on it. And then if I go over to the folder to the right of it, I already have my folder set up for my website. Make sure you save all of your .html files, which are your different pages for your website, under the same folder on your computer so that way it knows where to go when you're linking the pages. Once we have done that, we'll go ahead and select the aboutme.html file and then click open, just like that. Now that I have done that, I now can go ahead and save it just by going to File, Save. Then once I've done that, I can then go up here and preview it just like this in Google Chrome. And now you'll see I have an About Me link right here that I can click on and it goes to my About Me page here that I have already created in Dreamweaver. And if you noticed, it opened up in the same tab just like that and not in a separate tab. And the reason for that is because I did not set the target, which is down here, I did not set that target to be blank like I had told you before. But if I set it to blank, it will then open up in a brand new tab. Now the last thing we're going to talk about in this tutorial will be linking images. Now I want to link this image here of myself to go to my About Me page. All I need to do is select that image, which I have done here, and then go down to Link down here below like we did before, and then click on the folder right beside it. Once we've done that, we'll select the same About Me.html file and then click Open. Now once I have done that, I'll change my target down here to blank so it opens up to a new tab then I will save the document just like so and then I'll go ahead and preview that in the browser once I've done that it now makes your image a clickable image once I click on it it opens it up in a new tab right to my about me page hopefully this helped you out in the basics of linking pages within Adobe Dreamweaver it's very simple but a very useful tool to know how to do if you have any questions put those in the comment box below I'll get to those as soon as I can thanks as always for watching my videos again don't forget to like this video down below share it with your friends and family and subscribe to my channel for more great content just like this and I will see you guys next time